So we are talking about acupuncture. We are talking about acupuncture. Acupuncture is 3,000 years old. 3,000 years. Can you imagine? How long is a Western medicine, um, pharmaceutical and stuff like that? How long have they been around? 100 years? I don't know. Around there, isn't it? So, something that has worked for 3,000 years compared to something which is only about 100 years old. Which one do you think is better? <laughs> which one do you think is proven to work for centuries? Not decades, centuries. So as the topic of today suggests that we have been misled for a long time. So today I want you to open your mind. Open your mind. Look at things not from the inside of what you've been fed, but look at things from the outside, outside the box. All right. What about electroacupuncture? Well, acupuncture by itself is already good, but with electroacupuncture, it becomes even more effective. Okay, because thousands of years ago, you don't have electricity, right? unlike now. Now you have. So they added this electricity current, small current to the end of the needle and then they started using it just like acupuncture points but with the electricity and this started around what 1930s 1940s and so on and some say it's the japanese some say it's the chinese some say it's the germans i don't know doesn't matter it's been around for decades all right and it's proven to be very effective Okay, so let me go on. There are many points why acupuncture and why electroacupuncture specifically has proven to be very effective. So before I introduce to you this wonderful device, okay, it's all wired up. Let me take out the wire. Before I introduce to you this wonderful device and what it can do for you, let me talk first about what are the scientific basis for electroacupuncture and acupuncture? I have highlighted basically five points, all right? Five points, which I think any one of them will warrant you to purchase one of the device, all right? Any one of them. But I give you five, okay? The first one is stem cells. And this is the stem cells journal. And what it says is this, electroacupuncture promotes Central nervous system dependent release of mesenchymal stem cells. So what it's saying is that electroacupuncture can actually promote the release of stem cells in your body. And what do stem cells do? Stem cells are undifferentiated cells. They have no function. But when they go to your organ, it becomes that particular organ cells. So from undifferentiated, it becomes differentiated. <clears throat> so... If it goes to your heart, becomes heart cells. If it goes to your liver, becomes liver cells, pancreas, pancreas cells, and so on. So it's really clever, right? Undifferentiated becomes differentiated. That's why stem cell therapy is so great and expensive, isn't it? But here, it will be able to promote or stimulate your own body's stem cells. Now, isn't that wonderful? So that's point number one. Point number two. Is this nature journal? Nature. Nature is the journal that doctors, medical doctors rely on. That's the number one up there. Okay. Now, here it says in 2021 October, electroacupuncture activates neurons to switch off inflammation. Wow. I mean, you feel pain, you feel, you know, a lot of stuff going on in your body. In fact, chronic inflammation leads to diseases, right? Because of the environment, because of the food, because of everything that we put into our body, consciously, subconsciously, it causes a lot of inflammation, all right? And if you don't take care of it, well, you can have a myocardial infarction, you can have all kinds of rheumatoid arthritis and the list just goes on. It's a very big list. All caused by chronic inflammation. So here, 
Electroacupuncture activates neurons to switch off inflammation. And this is from the number one journal used by medical doctors called Nature. Third reason. This is from PubMed, National Institutes of Health, US government website. Acupuncture, now we're talking about acupuncture, right? Enhances gen generation of nitric oxide and increases local circulation. Wow. Circulation. Why? Why is this so important? Circulation brings nutrients, right? Your bloodstream going everywhere to feed the organs, the cells, right? So you need nutrients for your cells. And how do you do that? Well, enhances circulation because of nitric oxide. Isn't it wonderful? Okay. Number four, acupuncture and its ability to restore and maintain immune homeostasis. You know, our immune system is a great thing. You know, it can become activated and it can get rid of all these unwanted elements in our body. But overactive is also a problem. Okay, so the highlight below is too small. So what I've done is I've taken the liberty to give you a, a bigger one, a bigger picture. <laughs> Uh, fortunately, evidence suggests that acupuncture can bidirectionally regulate the immune system to maintain immune homeostasis. In cases of immunosuppressive diseases, for example, like cancer, acupuncture has an enhancing effect on immunity. Wow, this is huge, guys. All right. So point number four, huge, right? Conversely, in autoimmune diseases like rheumatoid arthritis, acupuncture has been observed to have an immunosuppressive effect which helps restore normal immune tolerance. So in other words, whether it's under, over, well, it will regulate, it will balance your immune system. Now, moving on, all right? Point number five later on. So here you can see that electroacupuncture can actually take care of a lot of these problems, all right? To summarize it, wow, it's basically A to Z, right? You can see from alopecia all the way, I won't read it, all right? It's just far too many. Essentially, it's this, guys. Acupuncture has been around for 3,000 years. It has been utilized to cure many, many diseases even before the so-called Western medication came in. Isn't it amazing? So when people ask me, oh, I have this problem, that problem, that problem, that problem, <laughs> can I be healed? I say, go try it. It's thousands of years behind it. The science is thousands of years behind it. All right? If you're so worked out about science, well, the science is 3,000 years old. You got to try it to believe it. All right? So these are all the main reasons. And let me go on now. <laughs> okay. This is the device. Taking a picture of it. And uh, it comes in a nice box packaging. And apart from this uh, wonderful device, okay, it also comes with um, this thing. All right. And you're supposed to touch on your skin, palm, back, Front and see whether you feel any sensation. There are two types of sensation that you generally people will feel. One is vibration. That means it's onset problem. Uh, the other one is pain. That means, well, there is a blockage. So these are the two types of sensations. But what do they mean? Well, let me now highlight to you. Okay. But before I, I go into detail, this is where we exclude, right? We exclude these classes of people, uh, those people who are strictly forbidden to use AccuLife IDOL. If they have pacemaker, they're pregnant, child under three years old, patient with malignant tumors, patient with hemorrhagic tendencies, they bleed easily, patient with tuberculosis and chronic alcoholic. Guys, this is the chart that is, you can download it as well from the internet. These are all points in acupuncture that 
connects all over your body with what they call meridians. So these meridians, they are energy pathways. They are different from what we study in biology and physiology, right? About your uh, system, your organs connected by arteries, nerves, veins, and capillaries and everything else, right? Different, totally different. The concept of acupuncture dates back 3,000 years old, started in China. It's about energy pathways. And these meridians, if they are blocked, then when you touch on a particular point, that point will tell you, okay, it's for gallbladder, uh, this is for your heart, this is for your eyes, this is for your kidneys, left and right, this is for your... Bank. You get a picture, right? So every point that is linked to certain parts of your body organs will be in the front or at the back of your arm and hand. Okay, and acupuncture points are in the ears and all over your body, right? But just here and here alone it covers almost all. <laughs> so that's why it's very convenient for us just to go through by connecting to this device, right? And see where the pain is or the sensation is and then refer to the chart. That, that is the easiest way. When you first get the device, that is, okay? Now, the beautiful thing is this device can diagnose. Yeah, I love this. It can diagnose, meaning it can tell you what is your problem, even before the problem occurs. Like in my case, I just give you an example. I got it and I touch on my diabetic point. I'm not a diabetic type 2 or no, I, I don't have issues with that, right? But I touch on it and I felt a sensation. Wow, immediately, immediately, I... Stop drinking sugary drinks. Any kind of sugary drinks from... I'm in the Philippines right now. You've got pineapple juice. You've got iced tea. You've got, you know, all kinds of... I'm not even talking about the milk tea and everything else. No sugar, everything. So for five weeks after that, I just went on completely. If I had to drink, it's only water. I only drink water. And after that, when I touch... After five weeks... I didn't feel any more sensation. So what does that mean? It means that when I touched it, I felt something that was onset, early, pre-diabetic kind of thing, you know? And then when I touched it again a few weeks later, I was able to reverse it simply by just changing my diet. So guys, prevention is better than cure, isn't it? Right? I didn't need any medication. In fact, I don't take any medication. I'm very happy at 60 years old. I don't have any medication. Thank God for that. All right. And now with this wonderful device, I'm able to treat myself every day. Right. I just touch from point to point and strengthen my organs. I stimulate them. Because remember, the first four points that I mentioned earlier and the fifth one, uh, I'm going to touch on in a short while. All right. So here... You have the front and the back, and there are many, many organs right in your body that you can, well, hopefully you don't feel any sensation. But unfortunately, no one is perfect. Everyone who is being diagnosed, even the healthiest of healthiest, all right, you think you are healthy, and when you get diagnosed, you'll be surprised. You'll be able to find out something right could be alarming could be an early detection warning to you but it will help you so this wonderful device is able to diagnose and it's able to treat so essentially it has levels that means the current is from level 1 to level 15 and initially when you use it you go on a lower level level 1 level 2 and then as you progress you're able to withstand the sensation, the pain. It's not pain, it's just sensation, right? You're able to go up the level. That means the blockage is reduced, all right? You're getting better. And you know you're getting better when you have a burst of energy, right? You cannot fake this, guys. Guys, can you fake if you're not healthy? <laughs> can you pretend to be healthy? I don't know how to pretend to be healthy, right? 
Because you, you look at the guy's, the person's eyes, a person who is healthy, the way they look at you, the, hmm, you know, and the aura, the energy, you cannot fake all those things. You cannot fake it. So when you are healthy, you know you are healthy. And not only that, people know you are healthy, okay, when they look at you, right? So you will slowly get better and you will definitely get stronger, okay? Now, many people, especially guys, when we get older, we have issues with our prostate. And later, I'm going to show you some evidence of guys who have tested it and how it has helped them. And hopefully, you are willing to try it and it will help you too. So this is a wonderful, amazing device that, yeah, I um, have no problem recommending because it works. It really does. Okay, let me just go on now and uh, share with you more. Okay, so here we go. Right, so this is the chart to, that shows the. It comes in a box, by the way. All right, and uh, next, I want to introduce to you is the number five. Remember, I said there are five reasons. The vagus nerve. It helps to stimulate the vagus nerve. So, what is the vagus nerve? A lot of people don't know what is the vagus nerve. So, let me give. You know, a few minutes uh, to explain. It's actually one of the most important, you know, organ in our body. If you can call it an organ, vagus nerve is spread all over your body, and uh, you can see the yellow thing. It's connected all over your body. That's the vagus nerve. Actually, it's not vagus nerve as in one nerve. It's actually comprises of eighty thousand nerves. Inside the vagus nerve, you have about 80,000 nerves. Wow. What does it do? Well, the vagus nerve is an integral part of, by the way, I'm using the WebMD and it's credible, right? WebMD. The vagus nerve is an integral part of your autonomic nervous system. That means everything is automatic. Like, you know how to breathe, right? You, you know how to respond and all those things are automatic. So it's the autonomic autonomous nervous system, autonomic nervous system, okay? Now, what does the vagus nerve do? If you look on the right-hand side, so I should cut short a bit, and you can see it regulates your heart rate. Is that important? Of course, right? If it doesn't regulate your heart rate, some of you will have fast heartbeat, rapid heartbeat, or slow, right? And uh, nowadays, after the COVID, you find that a lot of people have some kind of rapid heart, heart rate, <laughs> right? Like uh, they call it SVT, supraventricular tachycardia, you know, palpitation, and you find it very hard to breathe. Um, so vagus nerve regulates your heart rate, taste, speech, skin sensations, muscle sensations, Immune response, wow. Respiratory rate, your lungs, right? Blood pressure. How many of you suddenly after COVID, the blood pressure spikes? Okay. Mucus production, saliva production, digestion, frequency of urination, mood. And actually the list goes on. But guys, the vagus nerve is so vital and so important that signs that something could be wrong. And look at the list. It's so such a variety. Something could be wrong with your vagus nerve because there are 80,000 nerves inside the vagus nerve. It's so hard to pinpoint to where the problem lies. You know what I mean? So here, if you have these symptoms, acid reflux, abdominal pain, bloating, lack of a gag reflex, Difficulty swallowing, dizziness, fainting, hoarse voice, wheezing, unexplained weight loss, loss of appetite, feeling full after eating very little, nausea, vomiting, chronic mood issues or disorders, and it goes on. What condition affects your vagus nerve? Well, scientists are still studying, but it may also affect your mental health. Well, you see, because the you know the yellow portion of the diagram. 
it's, it's everywhere. Even your mental Alzheimer. <laughs> That's what they're saying. Alzheimer. And it goes on, right? So let me just fast forward. It's a lot to cover here. So this TAVNS, right? This TAVNS, uh, T stands for transcutaneous and A stands for auricular. So transcutaneous means anything that touches the skin and it runs through the skin. That's transcutaneous. Auricular means anything with the ear is auricular. So that's why it's called TA, stands for transcutaneous auricular, vagus stimulation. Okay, so that's where you have TAVNS. So that's the short form, all right? TAVNS. So what does TAVNS do? Well, first, it can improve your memory. The TA VNS can improve your memory. And this is a study done, right? And it shows that TA VNS was applied to the left posterior tragus during reading of short passages. And they found that TA VNS group exhibited better passage recall than the sham TA VNS. The comprehension, there's no change, all right? That means comprehension is what you study and you answer. There's no change. But the memory, that has changed. And look at below. Baseline memory was significantly correlated with memory recall performance. So it can help people to improve their memory, which is the problem with Alzheimer, dementia. Am I right? So there you go. TAVNS can help. Then TAVNS improves human working memory performance under sleep deprivation. So they did this test and they deprived them from sleep. And because they had this TAVNS, their memory is improved. Okay. So what is this TAVNS? Well, our device, apart from the acupuncture, you can also just clip this to your ears. Okay. Just clip this to your ears. And then connect to the device and just turn it on. 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, 15 minutes, whatever, right? Just enjoy. And with this stimulation, your vagus nerves, its efficacy and effectiveness will improve. Isn't it wonderful? Your memory will improve as I've shown you. And not only that, when you are experiencing this TAVNS simulation thing, you will feel happy, relaxed, your mood is so good, your aura is so good, because it's going to help release endorphins as well. All right? And that is your good hormone that makes you happy. And when you're happy, you're healthy. Right? When you are sick or depressed, unhappy, stress, stress is the worst killer, right? You will have your body producing like cortisol, and it's going to tense everything up. Vagus nerve inflammation contributes to... So if you don't um, take care of your vagus nerve, vagus nerve inflammation contributes to the sautonomia. Okay? The sautonomia. That's how you pronounce it. In COVID-19. Wow. So now, after this COVID pandemic, they have found that this COVID-19 virus has caused inflammation in your vagus nerve that contributes to a condition called the sautonomia. So let's, let's see what this the sautonomia is all about. Okay, and this is from the Cleveland Clinic. The sautonomia is a nervous system disorder that disrupts autom autonomic body processes. Wow, it disrupts your autonomic body. Remember what I said about the vagus nerve function? It's about the autonomic right, system, isn't it? Like your heartbeat, your breathing, you don't have to think or worry about it, it just knows, all right? So these are auto automatic functions like your blood pressure and heart rate. Having the autonomia means these functions don't work properly 
causing disruptive symptoms and these symptoms are often manageable but diagnosing and treating the sautonomia is sometimes difficult. Let's go on. A joint study by Feinstein Institutes and Karolinska Institute that details the connection between SARS-CoV-19, COVID the vagus nerve and hyperinflammation. Okay, I want you to focus on this hyperinflammation. A hallmark of fatal SARS-CoV-2 infection, COVID-19, is cytokine storm, an increase in inflammatory proteins within the body that can lead to respiratory distress and organ failure. Wow. Guys, I hope I'm not frightening you enough. <laughs> but it's the truth, all right? You, this is science. If you believe in science, this is what it's saying, isn't it? The COVID-19, I don't know how many of you have COVID. I had COVID once, all right? I got three shots, but I had COVID once. And so it could have affected my vagus nerve too. But then now, I have this to help me, to counter it, isn't it? And uh, if you look at the second paragraph, uh, this paper titled Vagus Nerve SARS COVID to Infection and Inflammatory Reflex Dysfunction, is there a causal relationship? So this document says there is. There is a causal relationship. So they blame it on COVID-19. Now, conditions and disorders. What diseases or conditions involve cytokines? Remember the overproduction, right? Overproduction of this, um, right? A hallmark of fatal SARS-CoV infection is cytokine storm, an increase in inflammatory proteins. So when you have this increase in inflammatory proteins, what happens? Cytokines are so essential to your immune system that they play a role in most conditions and diseases that may affect you. Typically, cytokines help you infect to keep you infection-free. However, too much of it is no good. If your immune system releases too many cytokines in response to an infection or treatments like immunotherapy, you may develop cytokine release syndrome, and also called a cytokine storm, the one that I showed you before. So too much inflammation can lead to what are the conditions? Number one, autoimmune disease. Wow, that's a that's that's huge, right? Autoimmune like lupus, autoimmune diseases. There's a lot there. Metabolic disorders. Metabolic disorders involves problems with metabolism, the process that allows your body to transform food into energy and remove waste from your body. So suddenly you eat so little and you put on weight. You don't know why. Okay. Cancer. This is huge right? That is probably the second or third killer. If you look at the heart problem, the stroke that is lumped together, that is number one killer. Then next will be cancer, okay? Sepsis. This, with sepsis, your body's inflammatory response is so extreme that you experience reduced blood flow to your major organs. Sepsis can be fatal without emergency medical treatment. So, guys, this is another document from sciencedirect.com, credible as well. And it says here, there's a link, vagus nerve dysfunction caused by COVID-19, okay? And another one, Forbes magazine, all right? New insights into long COVID point to damage to the vagus nerve. There you go. How many of you have had COVID? Well, this is the report. And it says here, from March 2020 to the emergence of the Omicron variant in late 2021, okay, about 3.5 billion, 3.5 billion COVID infections and reinfections. Guys, almost close to half the world's population had COVID. Problems with their vagus nerve. Don't you think you should do something? Can you afford it? Oh, can you afford not to buy it? <laughs> because the most expensive thing is not this. The most expensive thing is the hospital bed waiting for you. Something I wouldn't wish for you or your family. But can you do something about it? The answer is yes. 
you can help yourself, you can help your family with just this simple device, scientifically proven. I've, I've proven, I you know, five points I've told you what this device can do for your body, right? Is there still any doubt? Guys, you spend a lot of money and you buy expensive cell phone and <laughs> everything. And then you don't want to spend a little just to take care of your body. And you want to expose yourself to a hospital bed. Wow. So this is not expensive item. This is actually saving you tons of money. My purpose in life is to help humanity. And I find this wonderful device can do it. Every home needs one. And if you haven't got it yet, you should. If you're still not convinced after I've you know, elaborated so much scientific thing and tried to convince you, please talk or see the person who actually introduced you to this Zoom meeting and get yourself diagnosed. All right? and try the ear clip, and try the treatment. It will transform you. Even for a short meeting, it will already prove to you that this thing works. This is the factory, the manufacturer. It's from Taiwan. This company started in 1999. It's been there around, right? That is the founder. That is the chairman, Terry. All right. Terry Chiang. And uh, he's 63 years old, very healthy, right? He came from this traditional Chinese medicine background. That's why when this was first uh, invented, he went to see all the doctors in Taiwan. And he told the doctors that, hey, my device can diagnose and my device can treat. And the doctors laughed at him and said, if that is true, then there's no work for us. <laughs> Right, so they, 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 they ridiculed him, and he told himself that he had to get the U.S. FDA because if he gets the U.S. FDA approval, nobody can sneer at him or laugh at him, or you know, so everyone will be convinced. So this is how this is how it is. Okay, so this is Mr. Terry Chang, and guys, wow, I've never seen a company with so many registrations so medical device patents in taiwan in china in usa in korea in japan and also iso 13485 from the uk sgs iso there are many types from 9001 9, to so many right and this iso 13485 is specifically for medical device is in that category to say that it is safe and that's how they they you know investigate and uh, before they grant you the certification okay malaysia thailand indonesia russia australia and germany and even who endorses so a lot of people will say yeah okay sounds good any testimonies, <laughs> right? People love testimonies. Okay, you can join the Facebook group or you can, uh, you know, in the chat section, there is a link tree. Copy and paste it somewhere in your computer or phone and uh, go watch so many videos. And these are some of the videos. These are all the testimonies. And uh, yeah, now we are getting more and more <laughs> testimonies. All right, and this are this, uh, my good friend. Uh, Ty, and he is a um, very influential guy because if you if you're in the Philippines, you know Cam Aguinaldo. He's the advisor to the golf club, okay, and uh, that's the golf club that all the generals play, <laughs> all the politician, congressmen. They all get an honorary membership. All right, so and opposite Cam Aguinaldo is Cam Crame, which is the police. All right? So they all congregate there. So this guy, he's a very influential guy. And it took me almost two months, even though he's my good friend, right? He's so busy. It took me almost two months to grab him down. And the first day we were in the restaurant and he just tested the ear clips. Okay. He just tested the ear clips for 30 minutes. And listen to him. <laughs> 
So yesterday you use it for yeah, more than for half an hour? Yeah, 30 minutes maybe. On the ear, ear clips, right? Yeah. On the ear clips. And then I slept 7 hours 45 minutes. Wow, you had a good sleep last night, huh? You will feel Amazing. And there's a general beside him. He's introducing to many more generals. He slept 7 hours and 45 minutes. That's what the watch says. It's amazing. Okay? And he... He used to wake up a few times and he said he didn't wake up. He slept right through. And he's like, wow, even his prostate <laughs> has improved, right? So he's now promoting, right? He's now promoting. And a guy like him doesn't have to promote, but he believes now, you know? So he's sharing with the generals. And later, you will see in the Facebook, more photos of generals coming up soon, okay? <laughs> this guy is amazing. Now, it doesn't stop there. So we have others as well. And we're lucky because uh, with us, I know among the viewers today is also this gentleman here. <laughs> right? He's amazing. And uh, I just met him recently. And Warren has uh, hernia and uh, prostate problem. Hello, uh, my name is Warren uh, Cook. And I've been living here in the Philippines for about a year. Uh, I married my wonderful wife, and, and uh, I was from uh, California, and uh, uh, we got married on March 5th, and, uh, but on March 1st, I developed a hernia before we got married, <laughs> and uh, I tried all kinds of things to do something about it, and I was wanting to avoid the surgery. And I heard that it's possible that this mean machine could help. And just after one night, I noticed that uh, one side is all the way down and the other side is starting to shrink, uh, which it's a real blessing. So I will update you uh, on how the progress is of that. But the other big thing is that for years, I've been getting up three or four times per night to use the CR. And Sunday morning, I woke up at 6 a.m. I did not use the CR all night long. And uh, I went, wow, that's amazing. And it, my wife really enjoyed that too because every time I get out of bed, it wakes her up. So that's wonderful. And by the way, it comes with a two-year warranty. Two-year warranty. 